wonderful day. Today's video is a Wacky Wednesday video, so it is completely random, whatever I decide to film. So yeah, today's video is a Wacky Wednesday video, um, and I am going to be showing you a very small super drug haul. Um, now, if you've been with me a little while on my channel, then you'll know I have quite sensitive skin. Um, and the last two months, I want to say, I have been really struggling to find skincare that doesn't just bring me up in a horrible rash. Um, so I've tried Superdrug's own, I went back to my body shop stuff, just nothing seemed to be working. So I made a little Superdrug haul and I went with some simple stuff. So I'm actually just going to show you the products I bought, tell you how much it cost, that kind of jazz. So yeah, it's going to be sport. <laughs> it's going to uh, it's going to be a short and sweet video um so yeah the first product i have is the simple soothing facial toner um so this is 100 percent alcohol free no perfume or color no harsh chemicals no alcohol no mineral oils non-animal derived um Yep, they're cruelty free and vegan and it's designed with love in the UK. So yeah, this is the first product I picked up. Um, it just says, morning and night after cleansing, apply generously to a cotton pad, wipe the pad all around the face and for best results, uh, follow with our hydrating light moisturizer. Um, so yeah, this, um, I believe they had a deal on when I ordered. Uh, they might still have it on um, and I believe it was like a half price deal. Um, so this toner I got for £1.69 for 200ml, which I think is really good. Um, so yeah, that was £1.69. The next product I got, I've written it all down so I don't forget my prices because they didn't send me an invoice sheet. Um, I got a refreshing facial wash, 100% soap free. Um, again, no artificial stuffs, cruelty free. This one doesn't say it's vegan though. Oh no, hang on. No, it does. It does, sorry. It says pro-vitamin B5 and vitamin E suitable for vegans. Um, so yeah, it says um, in your hands, work a small amount into a lather, massage onto wet skin and rinse with warm water. Um, I don't know if these smell. I can't smell anything. Um, but yeah, so there's that one. And that's 150 ml for 185. Face wash always lasts me forever. Um, I don't know why. I think maybe I just use really small amounts. Um, but yeah, so there's that one. Uh, next up is the cleanser. So this is the purifying cleansing lotion. Uh, kind to skin. And where's it? Right, now this one doesn't say that it's vegan. This one just says pro vitamin 5, vitamin E, visibolol, and alan toin. Um, but it is still cruelty free. Uh, it says, if I look a little greyish, it's because my bottle is made from recycled plastic. Free, please recycle me. I did think it looked a bit of an odd colour. Um, but then when I opened the, the lid, it's like white. So yeah, I'm sure it's fine. Um, it says, apply to a cotton pad, wipe the pad all around the face. No need to rub. Avoid getting into your eyes. For best results, follow with our soothing facial toner. Um, so yeah, there's that one. And that was 185 again. Um, and this is where the two products I got um, next were sort of slightly more than that. Uh, so the next one I got was the Simple Protecting Light Moisturiser. Um, this is an SPF 15, UVA and UVB. Um, so this one comes in a box. Um, it's cruelty free. It doesn't say anything about being vegan. Um, but yeah, it says apply every morning on face and neck for best results used after our facial wash. Um, so this one was £3.45 for 125 mil. Now I believe this one is more expensive than your usual um, moisturiser because it's got the F SPF in it so it does make it a little bit more. I think the other one was around 160, 180 um, but I thought it'd be quite nice just to get one with SPF in it just to be on the safe side. So yeah, there's that one. And then the last product I got 
is from their new uh, Protect and Glow range. Um, so this one is an SPF 30 Triple Protect Moisturiser. Uh, UVA, UVB, blue light and pollution protection. So antioxidant vitamin E, C and ginger root. Um, again, it doesn't say anything about being vegan, um, but it is cruelty free. I'm not vegan um, with my skincare. Um, I think it's something that is great and if you can then that's wonderful but I personally don't um, choose to do it that way but I think it is an added bonus if it is um, but I do like my products to be cruelty free um, so yeah it says help to prevent from premature skin damage boost your skin's antioxidants by up to 90% and fast absorbing all day hydration apply gently every morning to a clean face and neck for best results use after our protecting glow express glow clay polish um so yeah this one was 6.99 um so it was a little bit more than the rest of the stuff um and it's only 40 mil so you don't actually get an awful lot it's quite a big tube and if you're only using it on your face i feel like this is gonna last quite a long time um but yeah i'm a little bit sad size wise for price um but you're getting a higher spf and it's obviously the triple protect one so that makes it a little bit different i did also order a um night cream to go with this um but they refunded me after a couple of days after i placed my order so i'm assuming it was either out of stock or yeah it was out of stock i'm assuming um so yeah, I only have the five products. I am a little bit sad there wasn't a night cream included because I took out a previous night cream and put in the night cream I got because um, there was one in a tube and one in a tub. So I picked the one in a tube because I don't like getting my fingers in the tubs because it will get stuck under my nails. Um, so I did put the previous one back. Um, so I'll probably have to wait until shops are open again or maybe just place another order at some point to see if I can um, get a night cream. But I imagine using the light moisturizer at night time is gonna be okay. Um, I did want to try more of the Glow Boosting range, um, but it is quite a bit more expensive than just the general simple range at the minute. And I think because my skin is playing up so much, it's quite sort of puffy around my eyes here, that it's probably safer just to stick with the simple, simple product and kind of go from there. But I am really excited to try these out. I haven't tried simple for a really long time. Um, and my friend recommended it and she just said, you know, it's for sensitive skin, just give it a go and see how you get on. Um, but I think it all looks very aesthetically pleasing. I'm just going to try and pick it all up. It's all a lovely sort of vibrant green, um, which I really like. Um, and yeah, I am really excited to give these a go. If you have a particular simple product that you recommend or you think is amazing and I need to get it, then do let me know in the comment section down below because, um, yeah, I'm looking to expand my simple range. I haven't tried any of it yet, so obviously I'm going to try it all before just going out and buying loads of stuff. Um, but if you do have a product you really recommend, then do leave it in the comment section down below. And fingers crossed, all will go to plan and I will be able to check out lots of the products you guys recommend. I think that's everything. Yeah, it was only a mini super drug haul and it was only simple stuff. But I am really excited to give it a go, test it all out, see what I think, that kind of jazz. So yeah, that's everything for me. Take care and I'll see you guys in my next Wacky Wednesday video.